Hey guys, Jen here. We are at the Build Expo in Dallas, Texas, and we stopped by this amazing Light Up booth. Tell me who you are and what you do. I'm Kevin Pruitt. I'm the owner of Light Up Permanent Exterior Lighting. We installed this permanent holiday light on houses, pergolas, and then any exterior lighting as well. So any landscape lights, tree lights, fence lighting. Uh, but we're here to display our outward facing permanent holiday light. Awesome. How long does it typically take to do an average size home in Texas? Well, uh, usually a couple days. It's not a very fast turnover. It's, um, you know, we take our time with it. It is a permanent light. So we want to make sure that, you know, all the details are covered and the house looks good when we walk away from it. Because yeah. these lights are supposed to be up for, you know, 15, 20 years, right? So yeah. they are permanent, a one-time install. So we want it to look nice and neat. It usually takes us about two days to do one job. Makes sense, makes sense, awesome. And what is your service area? Really all of Dallas. So from as you know, Sherman down to Waco, as east as Rockwall, out to White Settlement. So oh, okay, yeah. yeah. So you guys have got like whole DFW metro. Absolutely, covered. yeah, yeah. That's we awesome. we definitely travel. Uh, there's a lot of referrals that come in where we do travel for those as well. So we've even gone out to Pecos, Texas, which is out by Midland. Yeah. And we knocked out three houses there off of a, a referral as well. That's yeah. awesome. So I always like to ask business owners, because that's what I'm all about is business. Um, to buy leads or not to buy leads? To buy, invest, you know, get get that, you know, line of uh, customers coming in. You know, you have to invest into your company. Um, if you're not exposing yourself, if you're not buying that type of leads or advertisement, then you're not doing your, co your, you know, your company a favor, right? right? So you have to invest, get exposure out there. And that's why we're here, to get leads, right? Yeah. To get exposure and to find people like you guys that can help us with that, yeah. yeah. I always like to ask you, um, what in business have you gotten figured out? Oh man, I think managing people. Okay. Um, I think, you What's know. What's your one nugget for that then? Just being understanding, you know, understanding where they're coming from. Do what you're asking of others to do first. Understand their job role, their job responsibility, yeah. and then you can start to understand where they're coming from and what you know the capacity of that job role is, right? Yeah. So, um, I, you know, whenever it comes to lights, I've done installs, I did hands-on training before I start to you know peel away, let my lead installer take over, you know, most of the jobs. Right. Same with our you know the, our gutter company as well. I installed for a year pulled away and now it's just managing the people and understanding you know the a true expectation of their day-to-day -day. yeah no that's perfect what don't you have figured out in business oh man i think time management yeah. i think and that is very difficult for an owner mm -hmm. right i think it's time management just understanding priorities you know they juggle throughout the day something comes up it prioritizes how can i manage that time um, that but also giving others more responsibility and kind of taking a step back Delegating. and letting exactly yeah. and growing your bench and allowing them to grow under you yeah. by giving them more responsibilities it doesn't happen overnight no. um, but that's one thing I do struggle with is well if I step away and I don't do that anymore is it going to get done like how I want it to yes. um, so that is probably my biggest struggle as a business owner yeah. if there's one thing with your customers that closes the deal what is it I think it is being uh, punctual. I think it's being, you know, reliable and presentable. You know, I, I over communicate with a lot of my customers and I think that they appreciate that. Yeah. You know, um, hey, I'm 15 minutes late. Hey, we're 10 minutes early. Um, you know, whatever the case may be about a job from start to finish over communicating, I think actually does go a long way with a homeowner instead of, you know, leave them out to dry uh, and, and then text them the next day, hey, I wasn't able to make it, yeah. you know, being ahead of that yes. and just communicating with the customer. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you so much. Absolutely. I appreciate it. And I look forward to uh, your training that's yeah. coming up. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. Thank, thank you. you.